Hey everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Robocop Rogue City. I am your host, Callan Hill. I hope you are all enjoying this and staying warm during this polar vortex that's cutting through the Midwest and most of the U.S. As always, please sit back, relax, grab your favorite headphones, grab your favorite snacks, and let's get into the robot action, shall we? So sit back, relax, and let's see what the OCP, what attacked OCP, after last episode we brought Wendell to justice. We got a skill point to spend. Uh, let's put that in com combat. Something messed up. Oh, CP. Huh, no such luck. <laughs> That's a TV helicopter. They're here already. We have wounded. What happened here? It, it was furious. It destroyed everything in its path. What did? A monster. Robo, I'm in the Channel 9 helicopter. I'm seeing a lot of movement on the executive floor. I know exactly where that is. We need to get up there. No, we'll get the injured out of the building. I will handle what is up there. Positive. Let's see what is waiting for us. Murphy, we're finding more and more wounded, and they're all giving me consistent descriptions. So unless everyone is getting it wrong, there's an old friend waiting for you upstairs. You can expect... Trouble? That's right. Make sure there is no one left in the building. Will do, partner. Huh. Wonder if it's an Ed 209 monster, though. I see you. That thing just moved to the western corner of the executive floor. It, it, something. I... Let's see what it is. I'm excited. Okay, let's see what this big guy is. Uh, uh, what do you want from me? Robocop, my number one guy. There seems to be a misunderstanding. Becker's uh, Robocop 2s. This is going to be a hell of a fight. Wait 
You sold the city's future. That leaves one question. Scrapyard or prison, creep. Oh, this is gonna be a hell of a fight. Just an old friend. Okay, I hope I did not just lose. I might have. Nope, I didn't yet. I don't think. You will not win this. Okay. Whew. We're, we're doing this now, I guess. I know he's a weak spot now I can aim for. Right step. Side step. No, I wonder if they launch her.
This is this is tight. Let me get some distance. OCP recovery charge. <sighs> okay. That was that was close. Mercy. Because leaving him to die, there's a chance he comes back. Okay. Let's go, Robocop. Let's get out of here. That is a badass line, not gonna lie. Another week passed since the OCP's magnificent giant has fallen. OCP's new CEO assured us that the destruction of its headquarters will not stand in the way of finishing Delta City. Japanese corporation Kanemitsu has already shown interest in OCP's most prominent project, 
We at Media Break welcome them with open arms. Deruta City, Yokoso. From the City of Wonders, we're back to Detroit. The city's debt has reached a new peak. Re-elected Mayor Kuzak, asked about his plans for reform, said he had other plans instead. OCP is the weakest it's ever been. We'll sue them even if we need a Japanese lawyer, he assures us. Now it's time to introduce a new segment, You the Detroiters, where we share feel-good stories from our local communities. Disgraced Senator Farrell took hostages at the local theater and called for his reinstatement. However, a former vagrant and the theater's newest employee managed to defuse the situation. When asked why he decided to risk his life, Pickles, a European cinema connoisseur, said that it was simply disrespectful to interrupt the screening. Let's just hope Pickles does not influence the theater's movie selection. Finally, we know what is more dangerous than the lack of an ozone layer. Sunblock 5000 model torn to pieces by an ED-209 after not adhering to its instructions. The only witness to the tragedy, Dr. Olivia Blanche, was left delirious after the incident. She stated that mechanical lawman was not to be trusted. We will miss you, Melissa. A defamed reporter funded by terrorists after trying to illegally broadcast a hit piece aimed at OCP, Samantha Ortiz has been spotted collaborating with a terrorist group led by a woman known in the underworld as Bertha. OCP denies... We're sorry for the disturbance. Fortunately, this time it was a minor one. Let's move on. A new world record has been set in Detroit. A man called Funeral Bob attended his thousandth funeral this year. The record-breaking funeral belonged to Max Becker, a former OCP executive. As it turned out, Bob was its only attendee. The OCP delegation did not arrive due to a rescheduled business meeting. We hope the meeting went well. Moving on. The owner of a local restaurant, Onion Baji, in cahoots with a ring of zoo thieves. The restaurant was proved to source the ingredients through crime. The arrest was made by a rookie neighborhood cop, Ulysses Washington, and according to his statement, it wasn't the first animal he had saved. One question still remains unanswered. What happens to Robocop's human status? Mayor Kuzak distances himself from Robocop and leaves no doubt that he will not be advocating for granting him human rights. Robocop's efforts have prompted a public conversation. I hope OCP doesn't take him off the street. Who will protect us then? Ah! It's Robocop! Robo! I love you! Skeleton speaker! Pure pens of money. Ah. To many more years on the force, Robocop. It's been a busy time for Detroit, but the cloud that lowers over the city is lifting as police end their strike. We're ready to serve, said Officer Ann Lewis, who returned to duty despite her recent injury. What heroism. Detroit can sleep soundly tonight. The question is, for how long? That's all for today. This was Casey Wong. Until next time. And that is the end of RoboCop. As always, we're going to let the credits roll here. If you did enjoy this, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below. Share with your friends on social media. Let them know we're doing it every year. I like to thank everyone who helped me for this journey. I had a lot of fun. I hope you did as well. And as always, I've been your host, Callan Hale. Please make sure to hydrate. Medicaid if you have to. Eat some good food. Be kind to yourselves, be kind to each other, and in this year, don't let your dreams just be dreams. Make those dreams a reality. I'm going to have two cuts of this. Uh, one will be the full, and one will be just um, without the credits. So, 
or, or I might not, I'm not sure. I just put a little note. At 20 minutes, the credits start rolling. So thank you, everyone, once again for joining me on this adventure. I will see you all in the next series. Uh, Arkham is coming back. It's still going to be happening. Alan Wake is coming back, as well as Layers of Fear. Just have to get kind of in the groove again with the new year. And that is the last you'll hear from me for RoboCop. See you all in the next series and the new episodes. Thanks again, folks. Bye. Oh, uh, the credits did not fully roll. So we'll do a separate video for the end credits, I guess. But uh, again, thank you everybody for watching. This will be the finale of RoboCop. And we'll do a um, end credit video later.